Hello and welcome to your Drawings by Me art tutorial. Today you will be creating a face of colours. You will be learning how to develop your ideas as you create your artwork, using watercolours to create a background of colour and also matching colours to your emotions and mood. Today we will be inspired by a famous French painter known for using bright colours to convey different emotions. Do you know who we're inspired by today? It's Henri Matisse. Henri Matisse was a printmaker and sculptor, but is most well known for his paintings. He chooses his colours to represent different emotions and moods through his paintings, and favours using expressive lines. He is often inspired by other artists, including Van Gogh, Japanese art and Impressionism. First, let's take a look at the resources we will need. You need watercolour paints and water, a paintbrush, a black pen to outline, and black acrylic paint. This is what your face of colours emotions could look like. I took inspiration from a Matisse painting that he painted in 1969 with black Chinese ink. First you are going to practice drawing a face using simple lines and taking inspiration from the faces Matisse painted. You can take a look at his work to choose the style that you like. Practice drawing all the features and remember, just like me here, use simple lines. When you are ready, you are going to paint a background wash of colour using watercolours. Choose the colours for the emotions you are feeling and want to represent. Remember that all emotions are natural and you can represent both positive emotions like love and joy and happiness, but also negative emotions like frustration, anger and sadness. Add more water as you go and use your paintbrush to create lines in different colours. You can also create patterns or splashes across your page. Do whatever you think looks nice and keep adding details until you are happy. Once it is dry, you can paint the face using black acrylic paint. Start with the eyes and facial features, and then add the shape of the face and hair. If you need inspiration, keep looking at the different pictures that Matisse painted. He used different size lines, but always kept his paintings quite simple when he was painting his faces. And there you have your Matisse-inspired face of emotions using a range of different colours. Talk to your friend about what emotions your colours represent. Enjoy creating your art and remember to tag us in any pictures you take of your wonderful art.